On the 24th of April, Lee Westwood, one of the game's most popular players, will celebrate his 41st birthday. To mark the occasion, let's take a look at some of the highlights of his career so far. The man from Worksop started out life as a professional back in 1994 and has since amassed an impressive 23 victories on the European Tour, starting with the 1996 Volvo Scandinavian Masters, aged 23. In 1998, he was crowned European Tour Player of the Year following four victories. He achieved the same feat again in 2000, a magnificent start to the new millennium when he won seven tournaments worldwide and claimed the European Tour's Order of Merit. Fast forward to 2009 and another defining year. After rediscovering his best form, he recorded third place finishes in both the PGA Championship and the Open. He got back to winning ways for the first time in two years at the Portugal Masters, before peaking at the Dubai World Championship, which he won by six shots to claim the first ever European Tour race to Dubai. Off the back of that storming season, Westwood finished second at the 2010 Masters and did the same at the Open Championship. With classy performances now the norm, he rose up the rankings and in October became the world's number one golfer, ending the long reign of Tiger Woods. He briefly lost top spot but bounced back with consecutive wins at the 2011 Indonesian Masters and the Ballantines Championship, holding down the number one spot for 22 weeks in total. Apart from the highs and lows of his solo career, he's also been a great team player. Since making his debut in 1997, he's represented Europe in the last eight consecutive Ryder Cups, playing on the winning side no fewer than six times. A Ryder Cup stalwart and a European talisman, Westwood is one of the few golfers who've won tournaments on every major continent. With a victory in Malaysia last week and a ninth Ryder Cup beckoning in September, don't be surprised if 2014 turns out to be another great year for the man from Worksop.